What is up, everybody? It's your boy, DFS Up North, a.k.a. Josh Thomas here from DFS Army, and we are here today talking about Thrive Fantasy and their Thursday night contest between the Cincinnati Bengals and the Miami Dolphins. Tua versus Burrow. Let's go. As I said, I am Josh Thomas, a.k.a. DFS Up North, and I'm here from DFS Army. If you have not heard of us, what are you doing? You are missing out on the best content, uh, the best content site on the internet, the best optimizer on the internet, the best projections. Like, we do it all at DFS Army. I'm so proud to be a part of this company um, and have been now for, like, five years, which is crazy to think uh, that I've been a part of this family for five years. But we are here today to talk about Thrive Fantasy. Maybe you never heard of Thrive Fantasy, but I'm sure that you've heard of props. And that is what this whole site is about. We're going to get into it. I'm going to talk about the props, the house props, the game, the contest, things like that. I'm going to give you my couple of my favorite props for the game for Thursday night. And that is a excellent, excellent game. Two young quarterbacks. We got the Cincinnati Bengals versus the Miami Dolphins. Tua versus Burrow. Two, like, uh, the, the Bengals are underachieving this year, but really, two really good offenses going at it. And you know what? Their defenses aren't half bad either. Uh, we got a 47 and a half point total here, I believe. Yep. Uh, and the Bengals are three and a half point favorites. Uh, so I, it's shaping up to be a really, really good game. So let me, let's check out Thrive. Let's talk about it. Um, again, if you've never played on Thrive before, basically the, how this site is set up is that they have these contests, right? Um, so this one is for Thursday Night Football. This is their big contest, $20 entry fee, $25,000 guaranteed. Um, and look at that overlay, baby. Whoo wee. Uh, all right, let's see. Okay. And what you do is that you pick 10 out of 20 props. All right. So you pick 10 of these props and they got them for all the guys here. Uh, Joe Burrow, Joe Mixon, Jamar Chase, Tyler Higgins, or Tyler Higgins, Tyler Boyd, T Higgins, uh, even Mike Gusecki, Raheem Mostert. Uh, and you basically pick over or under. And the more likely something is to happen, the less points you get, the less likely it is to happen, the more points you get. If it's a 50, 50 chance, then you get like what we see here with Tyreek Hill at an over of hundred points and an under of a hundred points. And your goal is to get the most points possible. So likely by getting nine or 10 props, right? And first place in the contest wins a cool $5,000. All right. And as you kind of scroll down here, you can see that fifth to eighth, 500, ninth to 13th, 250. So these are really, really top heavy. So we want to build over here for upside. We want the most points possible. All right. Uh, so again, here's what I like about Thrive. I don't know if you guys have been playing showdowns on some of these other sites like DraftKings and FanDuel and things like that. Um, but you gotta be, you gotta dig in so deep and you gotta find the, the third string running back or no, like on Monday night, right? You got to know that Graham Gano is going to kick a million field goals um, and put him in the captain slot. You don't have to worry about, for what we call a DFS Army, the turds in the game here. You are you are worried about the top end guys. Tua, Burrow, Chase Edmonds, Jalen Waddell, right? All Tyreek Hill, these big time guys and what they are doing on the field. And for me, it makes the game a lot more fun to watch. So that is why I love Thrive Fantasy I've had a ton of fun uh, playing here this year, uh, and I'm super excited to talk about this game. So like I said, 47 and a half point total, um, you know, and they go in order here. You got, uh, you know, Burrow and Jamar Chase, and I'm going to find my favorite prop of the night uh, and tell you what it is right away. I am going to give this out first things first, and my favorite prop of the night is Raheem Mostert, 37 and a half total rushing yards. All right. We are projecting him for a little bit over that. Um, but really it's about a 50, 50 for me that we think that he, uh, we think that he is going to get a DFS army right around that number. Uh, you can run on the Bengals, uh, and the split between him and chase Edmonds has been pretty even though the big difference in the split has been that Edmonds has got the goal line carries, right? We saw Edmonds bring two in last week. Uh, and I really think that mustard is like, I, I I kind of love this number here. Uh, I'm really, really high on, on him this week. I think that he's going to have a big week. Uh, he's averaging only 26 per game. Again, last week, it was the Chase Edmonds week against Buffalo. Again, a tough, tough matchup. Only got 11 yards, but I think that monster is going to be involved. We saw him get 51 in week two. Uh, and I really like, again, we talked about having to build for upside. This is, in my opinion, a 50-50 prop. Uh, the line is right around here on, on other sports books. So really, this, this prop should be 100-100. So we're getting value on 
the over here. And I am going to chase that all day. Now, meanwhile, I actually like the Edmonds under here. And sometimes you got to correlate those two things when you're building lineups, right? If Mostert's going to get over 36 point or 37.5, and I am, I'm the time out, pause this right now. I am about a hundred percent sure that I am not saying his name right. It might be Mostert, might be Mostert. I don't freaking know. All I know is that the guy can play coming over from San Francisco. I think there's a chance for both of these guys to, to have, you know, decent games here, but I really, I, I like the idea of correlating these. So if Edmonds is not going to get there, that monster it is. Um, and we can get, you know, a, a little bit of correlation in our lineup, which you can do with props, right? We know that if Mostert's going, that Chase Edmonds likely isn't going as hard. Um, and then finally, the last prop that I am going to share with you tonight is one that may be a little bit interesting, but I really like the under here on Joe Burrow. Uh, we're projecting him for around like about 10 yards under this. So it's 281 and a half pass yards and rush yards. We're projecting him at about 270. Um, so there's a little bit of leeway there. And, and you know, I really think that this should be like 85 or 95 points in, in just in terms of percentages. Uh, so I am all over the Joe Burrow uh, under 281.5. And again, if I was putting this lineup in a contest, what would I do, right? I would, uh, you know, continue to build. I got three props in here right now. Uh, that gets me to 325 points. And ideally, we want to be around a thousand. All right. Around a thousand is pretty ideal, uh, for these types of contests. Uh, anything over is awesome. Uh, and the one thing that I struggle with here is you've got to take some chances on, touchdowns right we know how highly variant touchdowns are but you got to take some chances on touchdowns because the point totals are great so like what else over uh, getting a touchdown we get 115 um you gotta you don't have to do all of these like low percentage ones right but you gotta be close uh so for me i also think that the two completions might go under um, but i'm not gonna get there um oh there was one i got as i saw here i was gonna share with you guys just because you got to take it and you got to take value where you can. And that is Tyler Boyd over two and a half total receptions. Right. So I talked about taking those chances. Sometimes you got to slam the, the, the slam dunk point totals just to, to give you some, it, it caps your upside a little bit, but it, it, it allows you to still get chances because a lot of times in these games, uh, what we think is going to happen doesn't always happen. So uh, I want to take the thing that is almost a sure thing lock. And that's Tyler Boyd over two and a half receptions. Uh, you know, if Boyd catches three balls, he could do that in the first drive, right? I get 80 points. We just move on. Uh, and I can still get to a thousand pretty easily here, especially when you go, uh, you know, you take the Joe Mixon under, which I love. Uh, there's a couple more here, but I'm not going to give out all this. I'm not giving you guys my lineup. I'm not giving out all the secret sauce. So here's what I need you to do. Uh, if you've never played here before, use the code ARMY, deposit, you get a deposit match up to a $200. If you do $50, you get one free ticket, two free contest tickets for uh, a deposit of $100 or more. And then I want you to like this video. I want you to share it on Twitter, or whatever, but I want you to write in the comment what your favorite prop is for this game. I told you mine. Um, I love that 125 points we are getting uh, on uh, the the Raheem Mostert, Mostert uh, over on the rushing yards. Uh, so tell me what you think is the best. Uh, leave it in the comments. I'll hit you back up with a comment back. Uh, and hopefully we can all win some money over here on Thrive. And, oh my gosh, I forgot almost one of the most important things. They have, like, I live in a state where we you cannot you cannot bet on, on sports, right? And what they have is the prop lobby, which I love. Do they have any first half props for this? Oh, no, nothing. Um, but you can see the prop lobby, right? Uh, ooh, look at they, and these are up to date lines, right? And what you do here is that you have to pick at least two, you get two, you get them both, right? You three X your money, uh, 3.6 X. Sorry. So you can turn $10 into 36, three, to, three of three, right? You 6.2, 10 into 62, uh, four, of four, you 11 X 10 into 11 and five of five, you 20.5 X your money, $10 into a cool $205, right? So again, I think, we got another yard there. Oh yeah, baby. Let's go. So you can go, you can go mustard. You can go burrow, right? That number 287. I like the under on that, right? I could submit this right now. If I wanted to keep going, I could say, you know, do we get a burrow? Uh, we get a mix in receiving yards. I don't love that. I could take the under on the mix and receiving yards. Eh, there's not a lot of, not a lot here that I like a ton of. I think that 32.5, we saw that number uh, was was a little bit higher over on uh, the prop law or on the, the contest. So we could middle this and try to get the middle, but eh, I, don't, I don't love that play. 
Um, take the under on Gusecki. He's just not involved in this offense, right? So I could I could dump this in for 10 bucks and, and take home a cool, uh, what do we got? 6.2x. So again, another fun way to play over here on Thrive Fantasy. If you have not played over here, you are missing out. And again, if you have any DFS questions, you got any comments, anything you want to know, hit me up at DFS Up North on Twitter. Or you can find me at DFS Army. Uh, if you're a DFS Army VIP and you're watching this, hit me up. I love to chat on Thrive. Hit me up with a DN. You can hit me up in the in the NFL channel or Geeks channel, uh, and we can chop it up about this. So that is what I got for you guys today. Go play on Thrive. Super fun. Love to see it. Uh, and then show me those tickets. Show me those winning tickets from you guys uh, that, that you win over here this week. All right. Cheers, guys. Cheers.